In order to survive, such animals had to have the ability to move from a drying pond to one that was not yet dry. It's so funny because, like, yeah, I actually made a video about salamanders and why they're capable of venturing out into the forests. And I actually gave a somewhat different explanation. I mean, it's similar and it's different. I guess it just takes into account, like, different aspects of movement. Like, to me, the reason salamanders are capable of walking out into the forest is because they evolved in an environment that was more moist or more humid more of the time. So they weren't so scared of drying out, whereas... Further south in Gondwana, the amphibians there had the fear of drying out so much that they never left their ponds and they just became frogs. So that's a bit of a different explanation, but you know, watch my video, watch this video, and then you'll know both explanations. And both are right, you know, there's no correct way to illustrate the evolutionary journey that an animal's taken, or, the, or at least there's no like easy way for us to know that. So I, I would say both of these answers are correct, honestly.